We don't know. Um, there's some case reports, but they're just reports. They're not confirmed. We haven't seen um, sort of scientific evidence of it. One of the key questions related to that is whether or not um, the immunity um, that you get after being infected is strong enough and lasts long enough. So there is some infection with the seasonal coronaviruses, the ones that do cause common colds, that you can get reinfected. They have done studies of that. Um, but the reinfection generally doesn't cause symptoms, but uh, you still have virus in your throat. We really need to see better studies of COVID-19 to determine if reinfection is possible. There's a lot we don't know. It's a new disease. It's only been um, identified since December last year, so just, you know, about three months, really. You need to follow people up for a year, two years, three years after they've had the infection to determine whether the antibodies they produce to the initial infection last that long. We think um, from the available evidence, this, this virus probably lasts anywhere from four to six days, possibly as long as nine days on the surfaces. Anyone who's got the infection could cough and, you know, um, leave surfaces like uh, grab handles in the bus or a table or chairs or anything else that you might frequently touch, elevator buttons, door handles. Um, so you just need to mind, be mindful that surfaces that lots of people touch will have an increased risk of having contamination on them. And if you're meticulous with your hand hygiene uh, and make sure you avoid touching your face until you've had a chance to wash your hands, um, that will reduce the risk. The standard kind of disinfectants that you get in um, disinfectant wipes or, you know, using bleach or um, alcohol, they all should be equally effective. This virus can be quite easily killed by disinfectants. So just giving a thorough wipe over of the surfaces should um, help. The Australian Academy of Science. Because questions need answers.